Hey guys, and welcome back to Cameo. When we last left off, we were trying to find uh, the last sign, and... Oh, I'm not having a good day. But, I have certainly found what we were looking for. Oh, get up! Nope. Need some good old video games. Ah, cleansing video games. Um, right. Boop. Boop. And, oh man. But that's what we need anyway. And my webcam has been knocked. Which is, you know, cool. Right, okay, cool. So, yeah, we need to get up onto that second platform. Randomly enough, actually. Uh, I kind of thought it might be that one, but... Boop. Get out of here, you bum. Hot stuff, coming through. Yeah, come on. Come on. Nope. 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 Yes. Maybe. Uh-huh. Right. Cool. Nope. Maybe. Nah. Uh, uh. Still never. I never got the. <laughs> the hang of landing where we need to land. I don't quite get the knack to it, to be honest. But. It's okay. We'll get there. Just a little bit of uh, patience is all that we need. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? It's actually bloody hard. There we go. Okay. That's what we need. We just need the single shot. Oh! Right, so what have we got here? The game is done. You've won the day. Now take this fruit and go away. Yes, boss. Gladly. That's not what I wanted, but okay. Oh man, there's nothing in that one. Come on. Shake! Shake that damn plant and give me the fruit. The fruits of our labor. Sweet! Back up to three. Nice. Alright. Now, um, we can give that one a good old tick. So, find the question mark signs, done. Tick all of these. Boop. Right. Okay, so, with the use second, yeah, we've done that one. Boop. So, the first left house upon entering the level. Okay, so we've got to kill some trolls. We can do that. With the power of deep blue. Although, he doesn't really look like deep blue. Um, now, was it this house? I forget now, because I can't remember where we came in. Oh, it's not Squibble's place. I don't think. Oh yeah, Squibble's the dick that sold us all that crap, isn't he? Ooh. However, we can smash all of his stuff. That makes us feel better. And we can soak the bastard. No one appreciates your wisdom. No. No, they don't. Also, I found a better way of selecting uh, our creatures. If you hold down the button. Bad example. If you hold down the button, you actually get this wheel up. Which is a lot more convenient than going into your actual uh, book every time. Much faster. So, I approve of that. Alright, now let's go... Let's go into here. Come on. Oh, man, I hate the controls. Oh, my God, I hate the controls of being in water in this game. They're just shit. Right, ooh. Now, these guys... What we've got to do... Is turn them... Um... I guess... Opaque by hitting them with water, which I'd actually totally forgotten about that. Now it might be worth. What's our most offensive guy? Probably Pummelweed. Yeah, but they don't stay. They don't say hittable or beatable for a, for very long. 
and they're actually really annoying enemies to fight, to be honest. Okay, and I don't know what is going on with the camera, why we're constantly facing the wrong way. Kind of really annoying. Alright, let's concentrate on one at a time. Ah, you little bitch. There we go. Okay, cool. Come get your medicine, matey. You're flushed. Right, let's flush the next one. Yeah, I don't think so, pal. Now, I don't know if we can actually use flame. I don't think so. I don't think we can flame these guys, which is a shame. But we can just beat the shit out of them with pummel weed. <laughs> Give them a pummeling. There we go. Pummel weed does crazy damage, actually. Which is nice and convenient. Because these guys have so much health. Not only are they kind of annoying, that you've got to keep washing them uh, with water. They have tons of health on top of that. Whoa, you fought like a tornado, and it all seems to have calmed well. down here. That's great. This is all I have to offer, but please take it. Hey man, that's just what I wanted. That's absolutely perfect, my dude. That's a large. Oh, they're worth three, yeah. See, we're back up to six already, which is really nice. Killing the water trolls, job done. Now. So, we can't do that one. Can't do that yet. So, the next, there's actually loads um, that we have to try and get in a treasure cave, but we can't get into the treasure cave just yet. We need Chilla. I think we can do this one. Returning three pearls from underwater clams to the resident and his blue starfish underneath Major Ruin Shadow Troll Cave. I think we can do that one. And then, that's pretty much all of the uh, the fruit we can get for now. Right, and I don't think we can smash up anything in here. Hey dude, are you going to sleep? Seriously, bro? The local, I just... The locals won't go near the water temple anymore. They say some demon or other is lurking beneath the way. Now, you might laugh, Sunny Jim, but... They're actually onto something. To be honest. Um, right. So. Ah, the pearls. Now, I think we need to be deep blue, obviously. But, oh, okay. I was going to say, I don't know how we open these up. But I guess, I guess torpedoes. Torpedoes solve all problems. Hey, we're getting some cash. I mean, I mean, that's cool. Now, there should be th three pearls, but I don't know how we transport the pearls. Hey, there we go. Ooh. Right, so the pearl travels up here. Do we push it? Right, let's just turn back. So I don't have to bother with the controls. Oh no, we've got to push it. Oh man, that's total suckage. Um, let's see if we can... Okay, let's see. Can we blast? I mean, we can blast. Oh, I was hoping we can... We could blast the actual pearl that way, but no. Oh... Forget everything you've learned about 3D platformers in the last 15 years when it comes to the controls of this game. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. There's got to be an easier way than this. Surely. Surely. Oh, man. Okay. Let's just be cameo. Yeah. I, oh, no. 
I was going to say, I think Cameo is the way forward. I think. But. Eh. Right. How do we. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I mean. Okay. Kind of. Kind of. Let's keep pushing. Don't push my pole, you fucking prick. Mate, I'm going to stick that up your ass sideways if you push it again. Okay. Oh, man. Janky bloody physics. God, this makes me think of Half-Life 2. I mean, Half-Life 2 kind of got, like, physics right-ish. I mean, they kind of, like, discovered this new physics engine, so half of Half-Life 2 was just, you know, putting bricks on seesaws or putting barrels filled with air in underwater cages but you know it was new at the time a little bit weird going back to it now okay you know can you imagine that imagine like trying to open a door and um, you know the only way you can progress is by putting bricks on a seesaw it just like, it was cool at the time. It was something new, but it doesn't really make too much sense now. Um, ah, yeah, we're going this way. Now, this is more like it. So, once we get these out of the water, it's not too bad. But then Half-Life 2, I think, is a fantastic game anyway. It's just what was really impressive and, like, technical back then isn't so much now. But, hey, that's that's the way video games go. You're right there, my dude. Where are the pearls? Oh, we need to take them over here, don't we? Yeah. Alright. That's cool. So, there's a little bit of a push. Not quite sure. Like, Oh, dude. You would have thought there's an easier way than this. But, ah, can we kick these? Eh, no. Would be the answer to that. I would say that's a resounding no. Never mind. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. And I think we put these on the starfish. I think. Is that how? Yes. Yes. There we go. Right. So we've got another two of those bad boys to find. I got you. So if I was a pearl. Now hopefully that was the furthest one away. Oh god. We're back to this horrible underwater controls it's so weird to explain the controls because like um, the right stick does nothing but turn the camera you know in a lot of games the camera will turn um, your character's head or at least body as well and this it doesn't like all of the movement is controlled uh, with the left stick but you can't like turn completely in 360 in um, relative position to the camera like you can in modern games so it's really weird and the inverted controls when you're underwater is it's just bizarre it really takes some getting used to okay I think we're probably gonna get used to it but, yeah. Not for a while. Right, so. We need to find some more pearls. Wherever they may be. Yeah, and every time you get under the water, like, it just, it... Like, if you get an inch under the water, the controls totally change. And that's really disorientating. Because there's a totally different set of controls to being underwater. Um, as opposed to the controls that are above water. Whereas usually, modern games, they all control roughly the same. It feels like you're playing a totally different game when you're underwater. <clears throat> I don't remember it being a problem back in the day. But as I said, I never personally played this. Right, there's our pearl. I just watched a hell of a lot of it. 
Nice. Got some got some cash money. Okay. Okay. Now this is going to be the janky bit. There we are. Now these are going to make one hell of a pearl necklace. Or maybe we shouldn't be thinking about pearl necklaces. Because the internet has kind of ruined that illusion to me. You know, I used to be um, an innocent choir boy. You know? And then I discovered the internet. And lots of nasty, nasty things. And now I'm as corrupt as they come. Okay, cool. Cool. All right. Nope. Oh. Now, if we could push this properly. Come on. Come on. Nope. In. Up. Down. Ah, come on. This should not be as hard as it actually is. Alright. In there. And in. Come on. You really have to be quite accurate with this as well. There we go. Right, so one more. I am confident. We can do one more. Uh, I don't think there's anything down there. There's no pearls, uh, pearls in there. I think the last one we want is in here. And after this uh, episode, I'm going to call it a day because I have a headache. An insane headache. That is really kicking my ass right now. Yeah, trying to like aim at this. Like, how do you even... So, you've got to push that stick down and that one up. Okay. It's so difficult to explain how hard that is. It's just... You've got to forget everything you've learned in the last, like, 20 years of platformers. Ah, here we are. Here's the pearls. Right, aim down. There we go. Got some cash. That's okay. When we go to the next area, we should have enough cash to, like, buy everything we need, really, Later. from the shop. Because we're not going to have to buy any more purses, I don't think. Hey. I'm pretty sure we've got the biggest one now. Later. Okay. okay. Now, let's... Let's... There we are. Come on. There we go. There we go. There we no. Uh, 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 uh. uh I think pushing onto that beach over there's probably going to be the best thing to do. Yeah, cameo doesn't control very well in the water either. It's rather horrible. See the way she just like bobs up and down. Oh, come on. Ooh, no, 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 no. Stop going underwater. Her buoyancy is just weird. There we go. Now, if we could just... Can we actually get that above that, actually? I'm not sure. So there's like a little kind of lip there. No, no, no. That's fine. That's fine. Woohoo. Cool. We are all over this. Right, let's push it past the shop. That guy never sleeps, does he? He's like literally manning that shop all hours of the day. I mean, he should be awarded, I guess. Should be given a medal. Alright, get some nice nice load of coins there, actually. Alright, so this is the last one. This better be worth it. This guy better give us, like, a large for this. Bear in mind, this is the guy that gave us a load of shit. Okay. Oh, no. Fuck. There we go. Ah! No! Yep. yep. Boop! Oh, come on! Come on. There we go. Sweet. All those replacements? They're tiny. I'm not going to give you a cash reward for these miserable substitutes. But I suppose you can have this. You little maggot. Oh. Hello. Substitutes. Tiny. Get your own ship next time. Prick. Hello. Responsible for helping yes. your husband. If so, the art community owes you a debt for helping one of its greatest. Uh huh. Well, hopefully he like drowns because he's an ass. 
and a blight on the community. It makes you all look bad. Hey, we're back up to nine, which is quite nice. How many do we have now? Check your Almost half. In this part of the book. Hmm. We almost have almost half. In fact, if we get one more, that'd be pretty cool. Alright, what's in here then? Ooh, nice. Another health upgrade. And that actually will be over half. Yeah, because that'll be 7 out of 12. Nice. Another orgasmic juice. Foodgasm. Boop. Some cash. You know what? I don't even feel bad about smashing this bitch's house up. Or that dick's house either. Should burn it down, really. For being such a pompous prick. Okay. Now, I think that's all. Yep. Um. This status page rounds up your progress so far. Yeah, returning three pearls from underwater clams. Yeah, I've done that one. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Yeah, so I think that's all of the uh, pearls that we can get here just yet. So the only thing left to do now, really, is to carry on with our objective. Which... Um, I don't know if we can really start because if we do that now, yeah, we can start it, I suppose. What's the worst that could happen? Now, where are we going? Straight down, I think. I think. Oh, God. Oh, man, I don't know. Like, I can't even tell what's going on with the camera. Alright, there we go. There we go. There we go. Thread that needle. A desire for power. Ooh. Oh, no, guys. The water temple. You ever known a water temple to be good? Oh. That's kind of interesting. Hey, I think that's the last family member we have to save, I think. No, 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 we, we actually have two, that's cool. Oh, look, can we torpedo this big fish thing? Yeah, we can. Okay, that's good to know, it's a mechanical submarine of mayhem. This thing's just like dropping trolls everywhere. Yeah, we need to sink this thing. Sink this thing as quick as we can. Come on. Damn it, we're out of power. How much health's that got? 35. I'm going to deal with the trolls in a minute. Come on, regen. Come on. There we go. Is this just going to continuously pump trolls out? Even though there's already like tons around? Yes! Okay, cool. Congratulations, you unlocked a new action stage to play in co-op. Um, yay, I guess. Hooray for action stage and co-op. Alright, let's kill these guys. We've got some, like, landmines around, which is quite cute. So what have we got down here? Okay, well, one good thing... No, we can't blow that up. Yeah, one good thing is uh, having a whole water temple should give us a chance to get used to the controls a little bit. It does look quite nice, to be fair. Another bloody troll there. Oi, dick. There we go. 
I think the torpedoes killed in one hit, which makes sense because they're freaking torpedoes, you know. All right, let's keep moving. Going deeper into the water temple. Ooh. Oh, we've just gone back out the way we came. Well, that was clever of me. Said no one ever. But anyway, we're out of time, basically. So when we come back, we're going to go back into the water temple. And this time, not exit it and embarrass ourselves, hopefully. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.